That's so Pittsburgh. A group of local artists is rewriting the world of comics. They call themselves Comicsburg, and this weekend at Three Rivers Comic Con, they will show Pittsburgh how to turn an idea into a story that really sells. And we have two of them here with us now. We have DP Brown and Marvin Wynn, who have created and sold their own comic books, and they're going to give us a little demo too. So good to have you guys here. Hey, thanks, thanks for having us. us. And it's really cool what you guys are creating. So tell us a little bit about Comicsburg and what you're doing. Comicsburg is, um, you know, based in here in Pittsburgh. We're more than just Pittsburgh pirates and, you know, pierogies and penguins. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so I, part of what you guys want to tell is the story of how to put comics together, right? right? So mm -hmm. how do you do it? Like, do you start with a storyline? Do you start? Do you start to envision what it's going to look like? Yes. It starts with an idea first. So basically, you know, when we start the process, we start with the idea, get an outline together and then start the script process. So here we have like my project, The Theme of Thieves, we have like the script um, already set out. Um, and then when we get down to the art process, we have the inks, we have the color, and then we have the lettering. That's and, really and you don't do the art, you hire someone. I hire an artist. So okay. I'm the creator of this comic, um, The Theme of Thieves. So I hire my artists from like Upwork or you know Instagram, any one of those places. You know, I think that there's always been a huge following for comics, but I even see with younger kids, now with mm -hmm. graphic novels becoming so huge, more and more kids are getting into this and the idea of creating it themselves, too. Oh, yeah. Right, so that, that's what we're looking to do is to create a, a space where we can allow people to come into here and show them how to do creations. Like, we're planning to go into schools pretty that's soon awesome. and give them the whole entire process of going from script the store, to cons, even to crowdfunding if they if that's how they want to create their books. Yeah, okay, so what is this that you just pulled up here? Uh, so this is our um, project Beowulf. So this is from Grant Lankert. You know, he starts this process out with an idea, of course, outline, and then he gets into the script process. These are a little bit more detailed with the mm -hmm. inks. Mm -hmm. um, he starts with the with sketch right here, um, inks, pencils, and then he does his flats, which is coloring, and then he has his finish with his letter. You know, it is an mm -hmm. art because you're you're marrying the storyline with mm -hmm. the pictures, and yeah. there's a lot to that that gets right. complex. Mm -hmm. Now, you were talking about crowdfunding. Mm -hmm. How do you wind up publishing, or how do you convince someone to put your work in a store? Right, so I mean, that that's a multi-tier process because there's publishers you can take your project to, or like we did, we did just did it ourselves. We created a publisher uh, called Comicsburg, okay. and then we took our books to a di distribution. So you can either do distribution, uh, the biggest distributor right now is called Diamond Comics, or you can do direct. So you can actually contact stores, this is what Harrenberg does with, with, uh, with their comic is that uh, he called 200 stores and got his book into uh, 200 stores. Yeah, really so neat. it takes initiative, but it can be done, and you, right. yeah, you guys will map out the process. Yep. Right. And right. Plus, we also do stuff at Comic Con. Oh, yeah, so we, we, we travel around the different yeah. you know, conventions and everything, selling our stuff, um, along with you actually putting it in the stores. Just like the Three Words Con we're doing this weekend. Well, I was going to say, so that's coming up this weekend. Yes. So you'll have a booth set up there? Oh, yes. A big booth, yes. yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll, we'll have the biggest presence at the show. That's you know what, is, is the bottom line that you kind of get to be kids as adults? Because <laughs> comics are just like, right? I mean, doesn't right. it take you back to when you were a kid? My, my dad gave me my first comic at five years old. It was an amazing Spider-Man, and he didn't know it, but he he planted a seed in me that's still like, you know, just resonant today. And I created my first, you know, first comic like, you know, years ago. Right. And it was just a dream. It was a dream come true for me. Mm -hmm. Well, it's so awesome that you guys are helping other people find that passion yes. again. Thank you so much for coming on today. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. And Comicsburg will be at the show floor of the Three Rivers Comic Con. The event runs this Saturday and Sunday, June 1st and 2nd at the David O. Lawrence Convention Center downtown. And you can catch their From Script to Store panel discussion at 12 p.m. Saturday, too. We have the full list of attendees on our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com.